In this half hour in Bend this morning, where two people were killed in a shooting at a grocery store, the shooter is also dead. Fox News Chandler Watkins is live in Bend this morning with the very latest. Chandler, what can you tell us? Yeah, right now it seems like someone with the authorities is walking into the Safeway, making their way in there dressed in what appears to be a bomb suit. Police say this all started when a man left a residence behind the Forum Shopping Center and made his way to the parking lot. Their authorities say he fired several shots near the Costco and Big Lots before making his way into the Safeway. Police say the suspect shot two people, one at the entrance of the Safeway and then one inside the store. Multiple 911 calls sent officers and medics rushing to the shopping center. We spoke with Sheila Miller with Bend PD. She says as officers made their way inside the store, they could still hear the gunshots. Officers responded and entered the Safeway hearing shots. They found the apparent shooter dead inside Safeway. Uh, next to the shooter, they found an AR-15 style rifle and a shotgun. Um, and police did not fire any shots at the scene. In a press conference last night, Bend Police Chief Mike Krantz said almost 100 officers from several agencies across Central Oregon responded to the shooting. They say the FBI is also responding. Now, this is a very expansive crime scene. You can see the tape is far extending across this parking lot right now. Authorities say it's going to take a while to gather and process the evidence as this is a developing, ongoing investigation. As we continue to learn more, we'll keep you updated on air and online. For now, in Bend, Chandler Watkins, Fox 12 Oregon. Chandler, before we let you go, we know that person was walking in as we were coming to you live. Have you seen anybody else dressed in that manner go into the building? And do you have any indication as to why that person would be dressed that way? Authorities have not spoken to us since we got to the scene early this morning, but when we did get here around 2 o'clock, we have seen several regularly dressed officers in their uniforms going in and out of the Safeway. So we'll continue to ask officers additional information and we'll continue to keep you updated throughout the morning. All right. Chandler Watkins and Ben, thank you.